For those of you that have been following my work and research on this channel for the past four or so years, you'll know that I've discovered some really weird and strange looking anomalies on Mars. The one I'll be showing you now ranks in the top 10 for sure, folks. We're looking at a strange, massive either structure, sculpture or possibly some type of technology like a ship or a huge boat. Let's get right into it. I'll place the link to this page in the description below. So we're looking at an MRO context camera photograph and the anomaly I'll be showing you is located there to the top left and the scale is 5.89 meters per pixel. So it's not a really high res photograph like we see in the high-rise photographs, but the detail on this object is astounding. The site in which I found this anomaly is located in the northern mid-latitudes of Mars in a region called Protonilus Mensae. The site coordinates approximately 41 degrees 19 minutes north 57 degrees, 23 minutes east. We'll have a look at some of the other interesting anomalies close to the site towards the end of the video. He has a zoomed out view of the photograph and the anomaly is located to the top left. Here it is at actual one-to-one -one scale and I'm sure you'll agree with me folks, this is a rather weird item it looks like an eyebrow, check that out. And two eyelids with the strange pupil there on the inside. Or is this some type of ship? Let's zoom in on it and check it out. It's about 500 meters long. So whatever this thing is, it's huge. And if it turns out to be unnatural, can you imagine the implications? What type of logistics and technology was involved in the potential construction of this item. And there it is up close. Check these out, guys. Are these pipes? Strange Y shapes to them. Lots of symmetry and geometry to this S-shaped curvature here to the top. And then check this out. Very well-defined edges to this item. This looks like a type of a rudder. It's very weird. Check out the strange teardrop shape at the top. Then it has this rectangular base to it. With these long narrow parts sticking out over the edge. Strange spherical objects over here as well to the bottom left. So are we looking at a possible depiction of an eye like we find in Egypt with the eye of Horus? Or is this maybe a technological object? There's the artist's impression, a 3D illustration I put together of what I think we're looking at here, guys. Could it be a ship? We've got the outline of a typical canoe-shaped object over there. The multiple layers to it. The strange teardropped piece on top. Following a line of symmetry through the entire length of this piece. We've got the spherical parts on the one side as we have there with these pieces jutting out over the edge. Is this an outline of a type of a docking port? We find it harbors here on earth and then uh, was this covered over in sand over the thousands of years possibly? So let's head over to the northern mid-latitudes to Protonilus Mensae and the site we're looking at is right there folks. There's a brief look at 
the anomaly once again. I'm going to switch on the CTX mosaic to show you how huge this object is. It's actually visible from orbit. It's astounding. As I say, this object is about 500 meters in length. To use the measurement tool, I just want to show you the scale of what we're looking at here. So this length is about 480 to 500 meters. It's about 280 meters wide. And that teardrop shape piece on the top is about 100 meters long. The part that looks like an eyebrow measures about 600 meters in length. Let's have a look at another site down to the south where I discovered some more rather weird objects as well. Found that huge rectangular object that's about two and a half kilometers long and about 250 meters wide, as well as a strange disc shaped anomaly, it's about 300 meters wide. There's a close up of it. Looks almost like the Starship Enterprise without the nacelles, doesn't it? So, the question once again are we looking at a freak of nature that produced all these strange objects that together look like an eyebrow, eyelids and a pupil. Are we looking at a possible ship or some type of technology? Who knows folks, we need to go there to go and check this thing out. It's huge. As always, let's have a chat in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you think of this one. Are we looking at a potentially history-changing anomaly of your folks? I look forward to reading your comments and analysis. To my new subscribers, welcome on board. Thanks for joining the channel. Take care, folks. I'll see you in the next video pretty soon. Cheers for now.